right, you guys, we got the pumpkin spice, of course. What else? To me, the best things in fall are the scents, the food, the air, the new rhythm of fall. So I wanted to take you guys along on how I get ready for fall. I always stop by Bath & Body Works. I will be doing a haul later and also making my family fall bucket list and a DIY wreath. So if you want to hang out, just keep watching. I love this store so much. I have loved Bath & Body Works for pretty much my entire life, but I am with the million other girls <laughs> that freak out over their fall and Christmas collection of candles. They had some of my favorite fall scents they've ever had and a new beautiful luminary collection of candles that just give off such a warm glow. <sighs> I love it. So it's not hard to tell that I'm in my happy place. Walked over to Sur La Tab, which is right next door to Bath & Body Works. I think I'm saying that right. I think it's what it's called. They have everything you could need for fall baking. They have some of the most unique things that just got me so excited for fall. I mean, hello, glitter syrup. Yes, please. I really want to do more baking for fall this year with my kiddos. We love having pancakes on Saturday morning, so I thought it would be fun to get some ideas for fall spooky pancakes and yeah, we will go home, make some chili, and then we will do our haul. All right, starting the chili, and yes, I am using apple butter. It is so good. I am so ready for the weather to cool down. Can it just get on my level? I am so ready. All right, you guys, so I wanted to do a quick haul for you while dinner was on the stove. My kids are right outside, so I'm sorry if you can hear them. I'm gonna try to make this quick, but I got quite a bit at Bath & Body Works. I really feel like anyone would like the candles that I got. I had managers involved. I got the employees to come in with me, and I was asking them to smell. I was like, what do you think of this? How does this make you feel? Because I know that people can very be very particular about their scents, so I feel like I got the best ones. But I wanted to start off, let's just jump into it. I wanted to start off with something that was not a candle, but just the love of my life. Is this not the cutest thing? It is a candle holder. I feel like I get a lot of non-candle things at Bath & Body Works, usually a lot of decor, especially around Christmas and fall Halloween time. And I love that he's like iridescent and he glows and you can't really tell because the lights are so bright in here, but I just know that he's gonna look so good. And most of the candles that I got are the fall scents. I wasn't in love with any of the Halloween ones. I really liked a few, but most of the fall, so I feel like he'll really jazz up any of the fall candles that I have and make it more Halloween, which I love. So yes, he was a pretty penny, but you can't put a price on love, you know? All right, so let's move on to candles. This one right here, oh my gosh, I love this candle, which is surprising because I don't really get a lot of apple candles for whatever reason. Um, this one is very similar to pumpkin apple at Bath & Body Works, if you guys like Bath & Body Works candle, candles, can I talk? Um, but this one is apple macchiato. It says Washington's finest apple macchiato. I've never had a Washington apple macchiato, but now I want to. So, okay. How do I describe this candle? I need to like mentally prepare. Fresh apple, but there's like a warmth to it. It's not like a pie. I wouldn't say it's a pie. Let me just read you guys the notes and maybe it'll like describe it better than I can. It says, here are the notes. Washington spiced apples. Why does that sound so good? Hint of cinnamon, caramel drizzle, and frothed milk. I think it's the frothed milk that like makes it that makes it like creamy and warm. <laughs> creamy sounds kind of awkward. Oh, it is so good. I could not recommend this one more. It is just perfect for fall. Isn't that packaging so pretty too? Washington Finest Apple Macchiato. I love this one. The next one is Fall Festival. When I smelled this, I was like, this is it. This is the candle that I've been looking for because it's not too much of anything, but it is everything if you know what i mean so this one it's hard to describe so it's like my favorite candle for christmas the perfect christmas where it's every scent of christmas that you've ever loved just perfectly 
put into a candle and it just all mixes together so perfectly, that's this one for fall. So the notes are fresh pumpkin, spiced cinnamon, sweet maple almond butter with natural essential oils. I smell all of those and they're just so, they're a match made in heaven. I just love it. Oh my God, I love fall so much. I wanna eat this candle. This one is so good. If I could recommend one that I just feel like no one could hate, it would probably be this one. This one I would definitely recommend. It is so good. And by the way, Bath & Body Works had a really good sale going on, so love this. They have a sale like every single weekend and they're doing something new where they're rolling out a new candle every single week or like announcing one, which is kind of fun. All right, what's next? This one. I know I'm just gonna be so annoying. I love this one so much. This is Pumpkin Snickerdoodle. I don't know if they've had this in any years before. Maybe they have. I just cannot remember if they did. Oh, stop it. Oh my God. Why are you so cute? I just, <laughs> I didn't know a candle could make me feel this way. So here are the notes. It is warm sugar cookies, ground cinnamon, fresh nutmeg sprinkled with sugar with natural essential oils. I asked what makes this pumpkin and she said that it was the nutmeg. Sorry, I sound like super allergy right now. Allergy, super like, I have a lot of allergies going on, I can't talk. It's just the perfect amount of spice to make this not too sweet and overwhelming. It's just so sweet. It just smells like a pure bakery at this time of year. Pumpkin snickerdoodle, a forever love. I love it. So next one is leaves. Who doesn't love Leaves. I feel like if you don't love leaves, like I would have to take it personally. It's personal at that point. Leaves is crisp red apple, golden nectar, warm clove spice with natural essential oils. This is just the quintessential fall candle. It's like a fresh fall day. If you don't like leaves, like I don't know what to tell you. I just feel like you need to give it a second shot. Here's what you need to do. I'm gonna need you to wake up. I'm gonna need you to prep your chili in the morning. So it's like getting the house nice and like filled with the aroma. Pick your favorite Halloween movie. Then you're gonna go, you're gonna have the best day ever. You're gonna go to work, you might get a raise, people are gonna tell you you look amazing. Then 20 minutes before you get home, you're gonna tell your husband that he needs to light your leaves candle. Okay, you're gonna come home. When you walk through the door, I'm gonna be there. It's not weird that I'm there with your husband alone. Then I'm gonna ask you right then and there, do you love leaves? Can you possibly be sad in this moment? Bath and Body Works is gonna like <laughs> put a restraining order on me like you're threatening people that like our candles. So good. This one is cuddle weather. So I asked a girl that was working there what her favorite scent was. And she was like, have you tried cuddle weather? And I was like, what on earth is that? She said that it smells like chai latte. And I've been drinking chai latte every single day since I was seven. Okay, so here are the no notes. Warm gingerbread tea, cinnamon shortbread, a cozy blanket. I was wondering if there was a cozy blanket in here. <laughs> what are the notes? Why is that a note? but it does feel like so comfy. So I know why they put that in there. It's just so warm and, oh my gosh, the candles are so good. What the heck? If you guys get this, please tell me how you like it because this is probably my favorite warm, warm gingerbread tea. Cuddle weather, I love you. All right, this is another one I feel like very basic, everyone loves, but for good reason. Marshmallow Fireside. This is one of the first Bath & Body Works candles that like made me a diehard Bath & Body Works girl. <sighs> wow. It's amazing how scent can like take you back and make you feel just like happy, you know, if it's a good scent. But this one is Toasted Marshmallow Smoldering Woods. I'm literally <laughs> salivating right now. Fire Roasted Vanilla Crystallized Amber with Natural Essential Oils. Oh my gosh. This one just makes me so happy. I don't know how to describe it because it's not like s'mores. It's not too smoky. It's not too marshmallowy. It's not too anything. It's just so good. You have to smell it and you have to smell it lit when you're watching Halloween movies. It's just... It's just good times. I'm just, I'm not the best at these reviews, but I hope you can like feel my excitement. You know what I mean? All right, last but not least, we have 
pumpkin clove. This was actually the first one that I put in my cart. <coughs> Excuse me, I cannot talk. This is like so much work, you know? <laughs> pumpkin clove, this one smells like true pumpkin pie in the oven, but also this one is bringing me back to like a really specific time when I was little, like right before, I don't know if my mom like lit a candle or if she was baking pumpkin seeds or what, but this is really bringing me back. It's amazing how you can smell a candle and almost makes you want to cry. I don't know. Scent is the, whatever the phrase is. <laughs> Truest thing tied to memory? I don't know. But it is clove buds, ground cinnamon, a pinch of nutmeg, fresh pumpkin with natural essential oils. And it is <sighs> so good. I don't know like what more I could say about it. It's pumpkin pie with like a little zest, a little kick, a little sass to it. I love it. The luminary packaging, gorgeous. I cannot wait to like this one. All right, let's put my earring back in. My God, get yourself together, woman. Last thing, this is a fragrance. I swore I wasn't gonna buy any more fragrance this season because I have so many. I am so addicted and I love vanilla scents. And I felt like because I hadn't gotten a lot of Halloween stuff, I justified it in my head. This is Wicked Vanilla Woods. It smells so good. It's kind of like the Marshmallow Fireside where it's like marshmallow vanilla-y with a kick, like a little sexiness to it, which I love. Let's see. Hopefully my husband likes it. It's kind of hard to tell when you first spray, but I do love it. It is Magical Vanilla Glowing Amber Wood and Enchanted Pink pepper so that's where it gets a little spice i love amber wood i love vanilla magical vanilla that's special so anyways vanilla can i talk wicked vanilla woods so good i heard that this was like going around on tiktok so that's what convinced me to get it because it went viral so i'm a sucker love this one so yes that wraps up the haul Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. I know it was a little bit more long lived but I gotta go cook my family some dinner. My husband came in, he's like, are you gonna like get dinner together? So I'm gonna go do that and then we will do our fall bucket list. So dinner is done and cleaned up. It is finally time to sit down and make my fall bucket list. I wanted to hang this year's list up and I had kind of this idea to do like a half wreath situation, but I wanted some very specific colors, so I just decided to make it myself. All of the supplies I'm using is from Michaels. There was no extra wire needed, you guys. It was so simple. I was surprised how simple it was. I just used some tape and some wire cutters and had fun with it, started playing around. To cover the tape in the center, I used this white pumpkin that was from Michaels some bats. I love how neutral and whimsical it turned out. I feel like this is going to be a very crafty season. If you're into all things holiday magic, definitely subscribe. Give this video a like if you want to see more videos like this. So for the actual bucket list, I just started brain dumping all of the things that my family and I want to do going into this season. I don't know about you, but sometimes during the holiday season, it feels like there's absolutely no friction and it's like, wait, did we do the things that we wanted to do? It just flies by. So I love getting clear. I got the paper off of Amazon. I love how vintage it looks. Also, these Harry Potter stickers are from Amazon. I just thought they were so fun. I would love to know what your favorite thing to do is for fall, what your favorite thing about fall is. For us, we are so excited this season because Hocus Pocus 2 is coming out, so we're thinking of throwing a little party for our kids, and I'm just so ready for that fresh morning air with my cup of coffee all bundled up. There is nothing like it. So yes, I love how this bucket list turned out. I would love to know what you think. We are gonna be decorating in the next video. I cannot believe it. So yes, and until then, I will see you in the next video. Bye.